I'll show you how to replace batteries for this UPS for our main engine electronic system this is the insulation meter also we have a video about this how to resolve insulation low insulation this 24 volts and then this is the ammeter UPS power supply unit A UPS supply for our MEC unit B this is the the unit inside component inside our UPS this is the charger this one is a Vectron maker Vectron this is the whole overview of our schematic supply 220 supply coming from main switchboard the unit A is from main switchboard and unit B is for supply coming from emergency switchboard this is the current transformer this is voltage monitor for our batteries is the relays other side is the left side is the breakers K3 K3 relay for the and the K2 is for the supply main supply 220 and the K3 is the low to alarm this is the fuses that is the battery this is the battery one and two this one the fuse stop in the positive this big fuses f2 and f3 and F3 connected to positive this is the breakers connect to ECU ACU to our all system you can isolate here example the board is shorted this must be triggered This is the the right side the unit A this is the unit B This is our beside is this PCS cabinet This is our new batteries we will replace the old one This is rocket make a rocket sealed mf rechargeable battery this
this is our MOP MOPA and MOPB this is the main supply uh, power supply for unit A for main engine that is connected to the unit A this this panel unit A the breaker is F1 this one F1 will turn off that we'll check we'll check the alarms power supply unit A alarm failed MOPB and MOPA still kicking because the unit B is supplied the service right now is unit B no need no need to worry turn off A because we have a alternative unit B right now we can change easily I put tape on my 13 spanner for for safety only right now please carefully secure the cable because we will test this cable because we already disconnected the battery and it has a supply on it because it is parallel to the supply at the unit B you need to put a tape on it first thing to do disconnect first the negative then the positive after putting back first thing to do put back the positive and then the negative
at this time I cannot remove the battery without removing the case so we need to remove the case Before we turn on, we already check these batteries, but for now, we check again. 12 volts, 12.7, 12.8, 12.9, 12.9, 12.9, 12.9, 12.9, 12.9, 12.9, 12.9, 12.9, 12.9, 12.9, 12.9, 12.9, 12.9, 12.9, 12.9, 12.9, 12.9, 
then 12.5 before I putting these batteries I already checked 25.3 then need to turn on and after that we check again the voltage F1 turn on okay most 26 27 it's charging right now Vectron Energy Skyla that is the, our charger we need to check again 26.6 that is the voltage for our 24 volts series battery this is the old batteries rocket same brand same type sealed MF rechargeable battery. If this video help you, click thumbs up, subscribe, and hit the bell for more updates. Thank you very much. And then don't forget to like us on Facebook, Barco TV. Also, we have a video about how to resolve the 24 volts low insulation about this electronic engine just browse our playlist 